So one of the most interesting areas of research, I think, in oncology over the last few years has been the identification that the contents of the gut or the fecal microbiome can really impact on the outcomes of patients, especially with immunotherapy to cancer. We're only just beginning to understand this in any meaningful way, but several groups now have reported that certain kinds of bacteria being more present makes it more likely for the immune response to kick in and fight the cancer. Um, and so the question then becomes, is that a biomarker or is that something that we could modulate as if it's like a drug? And those are open questions. There are clinical trials ongoing to try to address this. On a practical level, however, patients really dig this and they always ask about it. And so what can we do right now? I think what we can say right now is that we don't know the answer and we should not be recommending to patients that they take probiotics because in fact, there's some evidence that actually suggests that probiotics might be worse. More generally, what we do know is that just like everything else, you know, three meals a day that are heavy on fiber and green vegetables, turns out that's good for immunotherapy also. So kind of simple stuff is the way to go right now, but this is definitely a space that's evolving and pretty exciting when we think about the future in terms of treatment.